Good morning, everybody. It's... Wait, who am I talking to? Sia Quill, good morning. Let's do good again today. Um, hello? Huh? Who could that be? Um, is Rescue Team Go-Getters here? That's right. Huh? Wait, aren't you? Forget it! We're not about to work for that. But my friend needs a gust of wind! Please! I remember now. Jump Pluff, we saw you in Pokemon Square. We watched Shiftry agreeing to take your rescue job. Yes, but Shiftry... He hasn't come back yet from the rescue mission. Are you serious? Our friend Jump Bluff got wedged between some rocks. We Jump Bluff can go anywhere if we catch a wind, but even though the skies are filled with thunderclouds, for some odd reason, the winds haven't blown. Not even a breeze? That is strange. Shiftry's leafy fans can whip up powerful winds. We thought Shiftry's wind would be able to dislodge our friend, but... But Shiftry hasn't returned? It doesn't sound like all that challenging of a rescue mission. It is strange. Oh, that's the spirit, Santa Quill. Your expression tells me you're ready. Okay, then we'll go look for them. Really? Thank you. No problem. You can count on us. Let's go, Santa Quill. There's no time to waste. Let's go and save Shiftry and Jump Pluff. Wow, this cliff is steep! Your friend Jump Pluff is lost deep in this canyon? Yes, I'm sorry to ask, but please help. It'll be fine. Let's go, Cinequil. Oh! Yes, what is it? There's something I forgot to mention. This canyon is known as the Valley Chasm, but it's rumored that an amazing monster sleeps here. M monster Yes, but it's only folklore. It's also true that Shiftry hasn't returned. I just thought I should let you know. Oh, 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 my stomach. Oh, it hurts. Oh, what's wrong? It's my stomach. It's suddenly cramped up. Ow, ow, ow. I think my breakfast was spoiled or something. Say, Cinequil, you're feeling sick too, aren't you? Cinequil, your stomach hurts too, doesn't it? I have no idea what you're talking about, Mudkip. I'm perfectly fine. Huh? What's the matter, Cinequil? I need you to back me up. If you're my partner, you need to read my cues better. Why this sudden outburst, Mudkip? Don't you have a stomachache? Huh? Uh, yes! Ow, ow, ow! I guess the cramping settled down. <laughs> so anyway, you said there may be a monster. What's it like? I don't know very much at all. It is an old folk tale. I wouldn't know if it existed or not. Okay. Well, it can't be helped. Let's just hope that monster doesn't exist. My friend Jump Wolf should be around basement floor 10. Please take care. Okay, gotcha. Let's get going, Cinequil. It then occurred to us that we had made a careless mistake. Mudkip and I forgot to tell Magnemite that we were heading out on a rescue mission. We felt horrible about it, but the situation just seemed so drastic. We rushed out of town as soon as we could. Still, the carelessness could just as easily lead to our own downfall, if we're not careful. Shiftry had a team of two Nuzleaf by his side, and the rescue mission was practically made for him. But even still, he hasn't returned. Perhaps this monster that Jumpluff spoke about isn't just an urban legend after all. I can only hope that they're all still okay, wherever they are. This chasm was enormous. It felt like we were falling into a bottomless pit. 
The further we descended, the foggier our view from above became. Perhaps that's why there were so many flying-type Pokémon down here. It doesn't exactly seem like a safe place to fly. Maybe they're all trapped down here like Jumpluff. No, perhaps not. I think these Pokémon are just fine in this environment. Mudkip had mentioned that there was this mysterious wind that would appear in dungeons over time. Supposedly, if you stay on one floor of a dungeon for too long, an outrageously strong gust of wind would carry you away and blow you all the way out of the dungeon. It seemed impossible, but multiple Pokémon spoke of this phenomenon as well. Well, at least that would help any Pokémon that are trapped down here to get out. Which then begs the question, how hasn't Jumpluff gotten out? Perhaps not even the mysterious wind is able to reach all the way to the bottom of the giant chasm. But if that's the case, you'd think one of these flying-type Pokémon would have been able to help Jumpluff get out of here. Jumpluff isn't like other flying-type Pokémon. They can't create winds of their own. All they can do is ride off of pre-existing winds. There were so many Pokémon that we encountered along the way that had wings and flying-type moves, and to think that not a single one of them was willing to create a gust of wind that would allow Jumpluff to escape. Perhaps Gengar's personality isn't such a rare case after all. I would hope that there were more good Pokémon than bad, but the world is such a massive place. Who's to say for certain what the majority is? I really wish I hadn't forgotten about Magnemite. Does that make me a bad friend? Or a bad leader? No, of course not. I'm not like these other Pokémon. It was a mistake, an accident, and I'm on a mission to save another Pokémon. I can't let myself get lost in such ludicrous thoughts right now. I just need to focus on doing good and helping others, like I always have, and like I always will. Isn't this the place where Jumpluff's friend is supposed to be? Oh, hey! We came for you. Are you alright? Yes, I I'm fine, but... Great, your friend is waiting for you. Shiftry is in the back. Huh? Shiftry? Let's go. Listen, are you okay? Snap out of it. Ugh, forget about me. Get away from here. Get, get away? What's going on? Why did it turn pitch black? It's coming! Move aside, you! He dared to disturb my sleep? I have no mercy for meddlers, and that includes you! Sh shiftry has gone! I am Zapdos, the embodiment of lightning! If you wish to save Shifter, then scale Mount Thunder! Zapdos. So that's the legendary monster. Yay! Saved! I'm so happy! But even though I'm safe, Shifter is in trouble. Please tell us exactly what happened. Yes. Shiftry whipped up wings with his fans and released me from between the rocks. But those winds tore a thundercloud in two. And that was when that monster appeared in the sky. That monster? They said it was Zapdos. Did you say Zapdos? Alakazam! Zapdos. It's one of the legendary bird Pokémon. I heard it had been sleeping for a long time. So Shiftry woke it up? No. Shiftry's winds were only the trigger. To begin with, the absence of winds there was unnatural. It must have been caused by the rash of natural disasters recently. Zapdos is enraged from having been awoken from its sleep. Shiftry must be saved. But Zapdos won't be easy. Its electric attacks are wicked nasty. I know that. We will need to be cautious. We'll go too. We'll go help Shiftry. What? 
That is dangerous. Zapdos is powerful. It will be too much for your skill level. Hey, we're not that weak. Besides, Zapdos doesn't scare us. Right, Cinequil? Well, not really, but... Um, oh, ow, 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 my stomach, it's in so much pain. No problem. Cinequil always does this act. It's always a fake stomach ache. It bugs me a little. That's a low blow, Mudkip. We're a rescue team, too. We want to help Shiftry. Fine. I see that you have courage. Yes! Our two teams should make our ways separately through Mount Thunder. We will go when we have geared up for battle. Knowing how strong our opponent is, we have no choice but to be cautious. You should make way for Mount Thunder only when you are fully prepared. Our objective is to rescue Shiftry. Let us find success. Yes, I'm getting excited over this. Cynequil, let's do our best. 